Welcome to the vent. Cheryl Lieberman, most gorgeous bride. Man von die Dach, das ist Partner. Cheryl's Jewish. Good Shabbos. And John is from a Christian family. Sonntag ist doch nicht sauber. Nein, bleib lieber nicht da. So of all the characters that you wrote, why did you want to play Lucas in particular? Because he's got the most lines. Oh, fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> uh, now look, uh, I, I initially, Confetti comes from a play that I, I wrote years ago called The Best Man's Speech, and it was a one-man show, and I was him, I was Lucas. Um, so I wasn't going to let someone else do that. Um, it was, you know, I wrote the part for myself. I, I felt like I understood that character, and I, I created him before anything else. and. Um, I love him, you know, I identify with him, I identify with his struggles, and um, he was the guy for me. Uh, similarly, uh, Casper de Vries plays the uh, state manager, Barry White. I wrote that part for him, and he fits it beautifully, and of course did it a hundred times better than it was on the page. He was very he's funny. <laughs> brilliant, you know what I mean? Uh, Nico's part was written for him, Kim's part was written for her, and it's a very interesting process because I know all of their work. And when you write parts for specific actors, you know what they can do and you, you kind of hear their voice as you write it. And it, it, it gives you um, a certain freedom because of also knowing their work. And um, I think you write to their strength. It's not always about who's the best actor. It's who's the right actor for a job. And I, I really believe that the characters in this film um, were played by the right actors for those parts. They're the right people, you know? But ding yay! Ik zit zanger. Ik moest een emergency band bestellen, maar ik kreeg weer de zijn. I think that Lucas believes that he's, you know, made a change and that he's that he's growing. And I think he is growing, but you know, um, it's not a question of absolutes. It's a question of th these are you know, human characters and they've got dimension. Confetti is not a, f a film that tries to create perfect characters. I think it's more about f characters that are struggling with things and struggling with ideas. We know that he's, he's gone on a journey and uh, we know that he's had some realizations, but for me it's more interesting to know that someone always has the potential to succeed and always has the potential to fail. And I think that idea does actually come through in the film with this notion of of trying not to be sorry and trying to just move exactly. on and make a change and not look he's back. Trying to, he's trying to take the responsibility. He's trying to say, okay, I'm going to stop making excuses and I'm going to do something. I'm going to make a change, you know. She certainly found her way into my personal wank bank. Leave for your, your old rocky. 